Here we are at a, uh, I'm not gonna say a hidden gem. I'm gonna say a gem of a place right here in downtown Phoenix. It is the Farish House and with me is Cinta. Cinta. There we go, Cinta. Thank you. Let's talk about uh, this amazing restaurant here. So cute in one of the historical homes downtown here. How long has this been here? Uh, we opened February 2019, so we've been here just over three years. Wow. And what's really nice, you guys have brought back kind of like what the traditional house was because this house has a lot of history here in Arizona. Yes, sir. It was built in 1899. Uh, Arizona didn't become a state until 1912, so we've been here before Arizona <laughs> even was established. Yeah. Who lived here? Uh, there was a man named William Farish. He was the first Phoenix City manager, so he uh, was the one that lived in this house, so that's where we named our place after. And what's really cool too, there's pictures on the wall here, and the pictures look like they could be the people who lived in the house, but yes, they're sir. actually family members of the of your uh, co-workers and stuff. Yeah, absolutely. We're kind of a little bit of a family place, so I have a few relatives up on the walls, um, and a couple of my co-workers do as well. It's a very interesting, neat thing to have here. And what's really nice too, it's nice and intimate, it's very small, so reservations are definitely recommended, especially on the weekends. Mm -hmm. um, but that's what's so nice about this. I mean, every room is so unique in a way when you sit in there, and it's almost like you're having a different kind of a experience when you eat here. Absolutely. Well, that's kind of what we strive here um, at the Farish House, is we really want to create a comfy, homey feel, almost like if you're going to go have dinner at your grandma's, we really want to spoil you, have a good time. Yeah, and the outside's beautiful too, which even though it's you know warm at times, but still nice to enjoy, especially since they have a full bar. Ready to go for it, so I like it. And so, and some great dishes. Mm -hmm. So let's talk about some. What's our first one we have down there? Uh, down here we have our couscous salad. It has a cumin orange vinaigrette, some crispy chickpeas, cucumbers, some orange slices for a little bit of citrus. Very bright and flavorful. <laughs> our, our next dish. Uh, this is our plum lavender duck. Uh, we do a nice duck confit. We uh, pan sear for a little bit of crispy skin. We got some French lentils in there, very traditional, and then some su summer vegetables. So a lot of French feel, I take it. Yes, sir. Is that sir. what this is all about? Absolutely, yeah. We do um, French kind of American comfort food, a little bit of Mediterranean influence there, a lot of comfort classics. I like that. That's nice. Okay, our next dish. This is our shrimp tagliatelle. It's a Marseille sauce. So tomato-based sauce, lots of delicious spices in there, and we also have a crostini with a Berber sauce aioli over the top. Nice. And then this uh, one right here, this looks like it's a signature one. Absolutely. <laughs> this is our double bone pork chop. It has an apricot rosemary sauce. Uh, also some summer veg, but a little bit more thrown in there, a little bit of sweet and spicy on this one. Oh my goodness. Okay. And you can't leave without having the dessert here. Absolutely not. And, and, I, and you lit up when this one came out. I lit up. I'm like, wait, she works here, but she's still lit up. What do we have there? This is our bittersweet chocolate tarts, one of my personal favorites. Oh my a little bit of fresh cocoa powder over the top and some homemade whip. It's difficult for me not to take one of these home every single night after work. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, we did say there's a uh, full-fledged bar here and some really signature and nice cocktails you have here. So what's this first one here? This is our Knickerbocker. It's a raspberry rum drink, a little bit of lemon, a uh, little bit of lime juice, a little bit of acidity and sweetness. So I like it. And then the next one? This is our Farish House Cup. It's kind of like our take on a Moscow Mule, a little bit of ginger beer in there, very refreshing. So, and then the final one looks so delicious. Absolutely. That's our whiskey smash, blackberry whiskey drink. Absolutely refreshing and delicious. I like it. This is great. So everything's right here for you. Now, you guys are open at certain times. So, yes, and what are those? Uh, Tuesday through Saturday, 4 to 10. 4 to 10. And you're recommending people make a nice reservation. Absolutely, yeah. Because it's, it's a very small intimate place and it gets filled up pretty quickly. Yeah. All right, let people know where you're located. Oh, uh, we are at 816 North 3rd Street. There you go. And you can't miss a cute little house right there. So you got to check it out. It's the Bears' house. And it's enjoyable.